for my 15th birthday, we went to the pound and I was able to pick out my first dog and it just came so naturally to me, like I just started training right away. Geronimo is extremely pushy dog. She's always looking for the move that comes next. We had this part in the show where a dog would come out, jump rope, like the ultimate thing to do would be to get a dog at the end to double dutch jump rope. I went home and I started working it. It took me six weeks, but I figured it out. She set the record in my backyard. The first record was 114 jumps in 60 seconds. And then two years later, actually broke the record and smashed her previous record of 114 jumps. Now I think it's 128 jumps. Feather is a complete clown. Like absolutely 100% knows that she's out there entertaining these people and entertaining is what she really likes to do. On the way home from the adoption place, I'm like, listen, all you gotta do is look pretty and look really happy going over like 54 inches. Then once she knew that, you know, going over the hurdle is what I wanted, she was like, oh, okay. And by the time I got to like 60 inches, like it was just like nothing for her. And the world record is now 75 and a half, so. She just amazes me every day. I feel like people have a lot of like misconception about rescue dogs, like, oh, you know, someone threw it away, there must be something wrong with it. But I really enjoy, you know, taking people's throwaway animals and making them into something great. They were probably already great when that person threw them away, but you just needed a certain person to come along and see the potential in that dog to make it even greater. I'm completely self-taught. There was no YouTube or anything like that. For me, the, the pride is I did it by myself and look how cool this looks. Oh my God. Oh my God, it looks so good. Real proud moment. It's really weird to look into the book and see my name listed and it's like, wow, I have that now, that's awesome.